Okay, what's up guys, I'm Oya94 and we're back with Kaguya-sama Love is War episode 10. I finally ran out of fingers for this. Okay. So last episode, some creepy behavior happened. <laughs> I mean, that was a bit weird at times with the drunken, not really drunk, but unconscious behavior and slipping into the bed. I mean, it's a bit weird. It was, it was more than a bit weird actually. Well, this episode, we're going to see if there's going to be any fallout from that. Any, like, memories. Any, like, oh, what happened yesterday? Why did you sleep in my bed? I mean, something like that. That should happen. But before we begin, don't forget, if you like this video, click on the thumbs up. Leave comments to me, telling me what you liked, what you didn't like, about the reaction, about the episode, what you want me to do in the future. And finally, if you want to see more content like this, then click on that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. Without further ado, let's... Watch. Okay, no opening sequence now. <笑><笑>食べてください Okay, so we're just gonna pretend like that the bad thing didn't happen. Okay. Oh, she won't forgive? Okay, yeah, good, good. No. Okay, yeah, good. It's not supposed to. いや、いや、いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、いや。いや、い
ないですか自分から誘っておいてよくもまあ抜けるようなモラルってのもあるんですよ。絶対めんどくさいですよ、その女。ラブコメだと黒髪貧乳にありがちなタイプです。ティピカルですよ、ティピカル。<笑>なんでエンジンかかった。ティピカル、イシガモ。ティピカル、イシガモ。ティピカル、イシガモ。ティピカル、イシガモ。ティピカル、イシガモ。ティピカル、一見清楚でお高く止まってるやつに限って性欲の出し方が歪んでて自己中心的なんですよ。<笑>男なんて興味がないふりしてるくせに。Okay. 男前に男前に男前に男前に男すぐらみあって。シノミヤさんは何に怒っているんですか言えない。え言えるわけない。<笑>本当は何かしてほしかったなんて。ごめんなさい、そんなに<笑>。みたいなところで怒ったりするじゃないですか、女って。男が女のすべてを理解しようとするのが、そもそも傲慢なのかもしれません。OK。What's gonna happen now? Shinomiya, o my new one, I can not an eye cotton. Nandiska. What? Or else, Shinomiya, and you be upon Fred and I to eat. Honto, you be upon the Kefreta. Did he? I don't remember him doing that. <laughs> yeah, that's the important question. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's romantic, I guess. <laughs> Stop. Like the beach? No, no, the beach. <laughs> can, can you? I feel like she. Her mind just goes in different places. You can't really rely on her. <laughs> See what I mean? Exactly. Like, she just too, she's too much of a wild card. So, Ishigami's gonna save the day, isn't he? Ishigami. <laughs> of course, you want to go. Good, okay, fine. Shinigami, Ishigami says to do. How much money do you have? <laughs> Well, then you want to go without them. I don't get it. Thank you. Please tell her. Exactly. Tell her. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> nah. Nah. You've lost. You've lost today. You've lost. Go. Thank you. 
Exactly, good, good. Ah, she has to lose after that, come on. Oh, padded. <laughs> I was about to say it. Okay. I was about to say, like, I know she's not. I mean, not that I'm looking, I'm just saying that I know she's not. Yeah. I'm just glad that they at least addressed what happened in the previous episode because, like, normally, like, you know, normally with this show, they've been. They have like a storyline and then the next episode they've all forgotten what happened so i'm glad that at least they brought it up this is like a continuous thing now it wouldn't have made any sense because i mean it was a bit creepy like from shiragane like no matter what you say even if she in a drunken state brought him in like when you wake up you see somebody on your bed that's not supposed to be there of course you're gonna be thinking like what did he do did he touch i mean it's only normal that it does make sense why she's upset about that. I mean, it didn't make sense why she was upset about him wanting to touch her. Because, like, you shouldn't be... Even if, no matter how much you like a guy, you shouldn't want him to take advantage of you while you're drunk. I mean, I know she's young and everything, but you're not supposed to. That's not... <laughs> That's just stupid. And I like that. I'm, I'm thinking they, they both know that they like each other now. And it's like, for me, it feels like they both are aware that they're trying to come up with different steps now to get to date each other but because like what happened with um, Fujiwara like even Kage was like telling Shirogane in her mind that forget it like you can't beat her that means that they both know that they're secretly trying to come up with plans now so the relationship has progressed compared to before I think if you go back to episode one I think they don't they both weren't sure that they liked each other like but I think now now it seems to be clear to both of them that it's only a matter of time like, so that's what I'm thinking. Maybe not season one, but maybe season two is going to be, like, finalizing the deal. I mean, season one, you get the contract out, you have the, like, the signing and everything, and season two is just finalizing everything. Good. But, I don't know, unless it's more than two seasons, I don't know if there will be. But, I think that they both like each other now. But, yeah. Ishigami is looking like my favorite character now. Like, I love what he did at the end there. Because I was just, like, I, mean, I was thinking, like, she was being selfish, Chica. So, I like that he called her out on her shit. And she ran away. <laughs> I mean, she ran away, like, like a child. Like, I'm actually glad that somebody was there to stop that. Because he was, he was getting on my nerves. I'm like, why are you being selfish for? Come on. Like, I'm really taking this thing personally. I really took it personally. It's like, he has nothing to do with me. But, like, I'm like, let these people go on holidays together. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Like, thank you. Thank you, Shigami. I like, I like him. I'm going to leave now. <laughs> and before we go, if you like this video, click on the thumbs up. Leave comments to me. Tell me what you liked, what you didn't like, about the reaction, about the episode, what you want to do in the future. And finally, if you want to see more content like this, then click on that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And I'll see you soon.